Yes, we, they won last week, Mark. I can't believe she just What'd won. What'd you win, right? Brenda? Coffee. Oh, gosh. She's going to win a car for her dad. Exactly. And a bike for me. <laughs> Brenda is like every other citizen, and she doesn't want to be. She doesn't want to be standing out like, okay, I'm disabled, so this I have to go there. She wants to go out in the world like everyone else, and that takes support. We raised her to believe that she'd leave home just like her brother, uh, even though we knew she'll be dependent, in that she'll always need support to live in her own home. But you have to raise her with that attitude is that you won't always be with mom and dad just like your brother you know and then you know when you lived with us even though she lived in her own suite she still wanted that independence I want a roommate but when you can't when you don't have a place for her to go that has secure support we're gonna follow you because this is your place do you want help on the ice yeah come on So when an opportunity came that she could actually move in with two other girls, have roommates, wow, that was she was so excited. So who are your new roommates? Do you want me to help you all the way over there? Catherine. Yeah. I'm Andrea. Uh, so you're going to go first. Okay. And who's this one? And Emily. Hi, Emily. Hi. 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 We're going to be asking you for your autograph. So uh, yeah, I like that. You have to perfect your, your signature. Yeah. So when people ask okay. you, can you... So you want yeah. She used to be my roommate, and in the morning she's not very nice. Oh, <laughs> oh I heard you Did you used to be Brenda's roommate? Brenda, I, I, I was your roommate. Where's your Yeah. 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 Mark, how was your day? Good day. Like Joan, do you want my chair? Oh, Brenda likes you too. She was telling me about you earlier. Yes. You and you, you, I just, yeah, I heard that you are uh, dating. Okay, so tell me about you and Mark. Me and Mark going on the date. <laughs> Ma. Can I come with you? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, what are you going to wear? Pants. Pants and? Top. Oh, that's perfect for a date. Do you want to call Dad and Brian and tell them about your date? Yeah. I'm both I die. You've got a boyfriend. How is he? It's Mark, die. What doll? Mark, the, Mark is good? In, in, in the day with me. Yeah, Trust him. He got a date plan with you, has he? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. You have a date? Yeah. You've got a date. Cool. After you go on your date, after you go on your date, you have to call us and tell us how it went. Yeah? Yep, you better. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Awesome, friend. I'm glad you like your new home, it too. It's a nice wedding day. Oh, yeah, I had no hat, Brian. As we are aging, we want to see Brenda transition into a very safe and secure community and to live with her peers and to live the kind of life that she has in the past. What it means for Brenda to have her own home is that she's out in the community, she has roommates, and she doesn't have any moms or dads there.
Brenda is like every other citizen. She wants to be included in society. She wants to do things like everyone else. And, but she needs support to do that. She's used to being included. She's never been segregated. And she's been surrounded by lots of friends and family. And she just doesn't know any other world. Families are exhausted. It takes a lot of energy. It takes being bold. It takes being a strong advocate. It doesn't happen. And, and you know why I do so much for others? Because I know I have the skill that so many parents are downtrodden, don't have the means, don't know how to do it, intimidated by systems. I'm not just advocating for my daughter. So the question is, does she want to come home with her mom and dad? No! <laughs>